Hi, I'm Dr. David Arthur with Colorado Functional Health in Denver, Colorado. I specialize in helping women who feel trapped by their unresolved low thyroid symptoms regain independence and control of their health. A common question I'm asked is, I read online that low thyroid can sometimes be caused by Hashimoto's disease. What is Hashimoto's and how do I know if I have it? Well, Hashimoto's disease is an autoimmune disorder that destroys your thyroid gland. It was discovered by whom else? Dr. Hashimoto back in 1912. And this was the very first condition labeled as an autoimmune disease. It is believed that approximately 90% of low thyroid is caused by Hashimoto's disease. It is the most common cause of low thyroid and the most common of all autoimmune disorders in the US. Autoimmune diseases, if you look at them as a single group, far outnumber the cases of cancer, heart disease, and diabetes and stroke put together. Personally, I cannot believe how many people with thyroid disease have never even heard about this disorder. But when you understand what the treatment for Hashimoto's is, is no different than plain old low thyroid, it begins to make a little sense. It is not commonly tested for in today's model of thyroid management, although it is very easy to get the necessary testing. There are two important blood markers needed to properly test for Hashimoto's. Without performing both tests together, you may have at least a 30% chance of missing this disease. Furthermore, having an autoimmune disorder is an immediate threat for continued immune attack on the body and risk for additional autoimmune reactions. The only approved treatment in the conventional medical system is thyroid replacement hormone, and that is all that is typically offered. Even though Hashimoto's isn't a thyroid problem, it's an immune problem, and currently, Conventional healthcare doesn't have a strong model to successfully support somebody with Hashimoto's, and it is extremely common for people with Hashimoto's to live a life of continual struggle with low thyroid symptoms, even while they're on medication. And this is because the approach for them is directed at their thyroid and not at resolving the symptoms caused by this disease. Understanding the connection between your symptoms and Hashimoto's is critical to your success. Do you want to find out what the missing pieces are with your thyroid symptoms? Please contact our office today to schedule your consultation with me.